all right guys welcome back to the channel and in today's video we're starting the retro revisited series today i'm playing atv3 um, this is one of the games i grew up on i really love racing games and it kind of makes me want to play driving an atv sometime in the near future but uh we're gonna be playing this uh this is actually a second recording of this game the first one the sound was a little too loud i've already went back through and edit the sound so you guys may not hear the music as much but that's okay because it was all copyrighted anyway so <laughs> it doesn't matter but um let's get into it um in the last video i think i had um started this little um olympics so we're just gonna finish it maybe these races are kind of long it depends on the length of the track and the laps that you have to do but uh we should be fine hope the sound is good i might turn my mic up a little bit more let's see you really don't need to hear the music i mean it is good music but <laughs> you two don't like that so we're not gonna have that in there all right so as this is the first um retro revisited video uh like i said it's just me playing through games that i played when i was younger ps2 ps1 um there might be some game boy games i'm thinking of some game boy games uh let me see. I didn't really grow up with Xbox or Nintendo, but if there's any games that I want to do a video on, I will probably do. Alright, but let's get into it. I haven't played this in a minute. Okay. How the fuck? Oh, okay. I have not played this. So the last time I played this was for that video, but that was like... I recorded that. That was in like October. October, November. And I haven't played it since because I've beaten most of the um, tournaments. On normal, I still gotta do the hard ones, but we're probably not gonna do that. Oh, this is a short track. Oh, this is one of those, like, yeah, this is one of the short tracks. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be easy. It's just driving around a shorter track. Uh, but what was I saying? Um, on, trying to focus. But yeah, this is, um, this is the first video of the series. The next video, I think, will be ATV2. Um, I like ATV3 more than 2, so that's why I'm going to do ATV3 first, and then I'll do 2 afterwards. But 2 came out, obviously, before 3. I played that one a lot as well. Uh, I like the tracks more in um, 2 than I do 3, though. Well, no, I actually like the tracks more in 3 than 2, because they have a more variety with the weather and the um, conditions of the track that actually play a part in how you have to prepare for the track. So some tracks might have like ice on them, sand, uh, mud, water. And you have to have according um, wheels for it or else you're not going to be able to do well on the track. So ATV2 didn't really have that. I don't even think they had different type of um, weather conditions on their track. I think it was all just normal dry dirt tracks. And you only had one wheel, um, one type of wheel. But you can change, obviously you can change your ATV to any ATV that you want. But it was all just one wheel. Uh, I feel like I'm loud. With this mic, I might change. I might turn my mic down. I can't tell. I'm looking at OBS on my other monitor to check and see. Um, but shoot, I don't even see nobody else. I'm just talking to y'all. Oh, he right behind me. No, that's not good. I think I put the Chico's in to get one of the faster bikes. So I ain't gonna lie to you. I am kind of dusting them though. They won't let you get the fastest bike with the Chico. You gotta pay for it. Um, and you just get the money from just doing the doing the um challenges i don't think you can you get there's a cheat code to put to get money but it's not gonna give you enough and i don't think you can do it more than once so you still kind of have to play the game a little bit if you want to get the fastest bike on uh, atv sorry um but yeah i really love atv3 man this music is nostalgic even though i can barely hear because i had to turn it down because of youtube sorry youtube um <laughs> but yeah i love the music um love the tracks it's just a very chill kind of game, like one of those, what do they call them, comfort games for me. Um, I had a lot of funny moments on this one and ATV2, and more so ATV2, uh, since it's a little bit older. The controls aren't as tight as they are in this game. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much what the Retro Visit is. It's kind of more so like, I guess you could say it's like a mini walkthrough. Not even a walkthrough, it's kind of more so just like a one-off. Of any kind of older game that I used to play when I was growing up. Uh, what's the pause button? Yeah, these videos will not be. Let's continue championship. These videos aren't going to be long. Most of the time, they'll be probably between like 15, 20 minutes. Some of them might be longer. It just depends on what I was recording. 
um uh, the video that's gonna be the last video for the month um will be Teen Titans. I'm just gonna tell you guys now. I'll probably make a little once I um uh, the posts have already been out when I made this video, but uh I'll probably make like another little small story post or something on Twitter and let you guys know what videos will be first. So Retro Revisited will be this month. Next month there'll be two Retro Revisited videos because I have another series um starting in March as well. And then from then on we'll probably do them i'm wondering if i might just have them dedicated to sundays because i know i don't have a videos on sundays but i might start putting these on sundays or i might do another series on sundays we'll see um because after that series in march i'm not going to really have another like major series for the channel so it could probably just be retroly visited um and eventually falcons versus once i start recording some more content with some friends of mine i got something cooking with last of us Okay, alright. How do you hop, 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 hop? <clears throat> Don't talk and drive, kids. Let's try this again. What was I saying? Oh, it's camera angle. I can't switch my camera angle. How do you switch it? Oh, fuck it. I'll just race enough. It's six or later. What was I saying before I ran into a rock? Uh. I do not like this camera angle, man. Ugh. I can't explain to y'all why I don't like it. It's just, I don't like being up close. Even when I was playing CTR, um, ooh, please. When I was playing CTR, I don't play with the camera that's up close to them. I like to be a little bit further back. I think I did in the original game because I don't think the original game really had that many options to switch the camera, but um, in the remake, I did not like being this up close on their back it, i don't know what it is it's just i feel like you get more um how can i put it it's better depth of um, field like you can see more of the track because i just don't like being all crunched up behind the other uh, driver like this but it's all good i'm just trying to catch back up so honestly it probably doesn't even matter i think i won most of the tracks before i started recording this so i mean we're chilling i'm just chilling at this point what was I saying before I got confused? Uh, yeah, so Falcon Versus is coming back. Um, I do not know when. We might just end up, I might end up doing it for April. Uh, I was trying to get a few friends to play. Um, like one more, really one more friend. See what he does. If we can get him to play, then yeah, it'll definitely come on April. Well, it'll come on April regardless. Uh, it will probably take the place of what the naruto storm series and what retro revisit is on now on saturdays it'll probably be on saturdays in april here on out um there's gonna be some other games i gotta put on the channel as well uh there's definitely gonna be some more dragon ball some more naruto um i'm gonna have a series as well kind of sort of um uh, playing a certain like party game um we'll talk to you guys about that later once i decide on when i want to um start that series it might be in may i don't know we'll see uh but yeah we got that coming as well so like i said there's a lot of content coming for the channel whoever put that damn rock right there needs to be fired bro. that rock is dangerously just sticking out on the edge bro. that is a safety hazard for people like me that have no damn situational awareness okay there we go all right so, we'll do one more track. I think the next track is the last track. Um, but yeah, that's what I got coming for the channel. Uh, like I said, I have to re-record both ATV 2 and 3 because I don't know why the sound is so loud in those games. And it's just... Oh, let me turn this mic down. I feel like I'm too loud. I can't never tell when I'm recording. But um, yeah, the sound, the music was incredibly loud you couldn't even hear me talking <laughs> that's just how loud it was so i was like yeah i'm gonna um redo these real quick and then that way they can actually hear me is this a waypoint oh my god they can actually have a waypoint so this game has different um different type of like race types so the last two tracks that i did they were technically considered a type they were called short tracks right so short tracks you do usually like a glorified circle um you do like 10 laps around the track uh it can be any weather condition so that's why you have to prepare for that this is waypoint so this is more like a checkpoint race you'll have these different fences around the map 
a little kind of pseudo free roaming. Um, there's no dedicated way to. I'm gonna. Okay. There's no dedicated way to go. You just have to get through all of the checkpoints in um, sequential order. And then you just do three laps. It's like a regular race. Um, you also have. You also have um, time attack, so that's why I didn't do a time trial series on this game because it's not a, necessarily a time trial, it's a time attack. You just keep doing laps until you just get tired of doing laps. So I didn't do that, I went the wrong way. I didn't want to put it. Uh, so you have that, and then they separate the different types of track into two main like categories. You have the supercross track, which are the little races in the arena. Have you ever seen like a um, motorsport? I don't know, like an event event. God fucking damn it. Have you ever seen a motorsport event? Um, like when they're in like an arena and there's like mud all over the tracks and stuff. That is essentially what the Supercross track is. I might end up doing a Supercross race in the um, ATV2 uh, video when I do that after I record this. Uh, and then this track itself. Obviously this is a type, but the track itself is I forgot what it's called. Something started with an S4s. Um, is considered. I forgot what the fuck they call these type of tracks. Uh, what do they call these tracks? I forgot what they call them. Um, I'm gonna look at it after we get through with this race. Um, but you have those tracks as well. They're more like just general tracks. You can be racing in like a, a canyon, a forest, um, ice cave, uh, like a dam stuff like that just like random like environments those are what those are they're not based off of um, an arena or anything like that and then outside of that you have um I need to slow down a bit because um, slow down God damn, can I slow down that that turn always gets me bro <laughs> but it also gets the AI too because whoever thought that putting that putting that ramp right there or not that ramp but that um that slope and then putting a checkpoint right at the end of the slope and then want you to, want you to turn right after it is insane because you're not getting down that turn slowly even if you don't go even if you don't accelerate down the turn you're still going to be speeding down the track so i don't know who did that but man, i'm not here to critique game design right now <laughs> i got my own game to worry about but um yeah so those are the types um you also got like stunt I ain't doing those stunts right now because, you know, I'm trying to focus, but the game has a lot of different, like, stunts that you can do, wheelies, um, all the other shit that they have you doing in this game, uh, and then that's its own little mode as well, and then outside of that, that's really it, there's no, there's no other modes, uh, they got, like, multiplayer modes that I would love to play, but I have nobody to play them with, so you will not be seeing them because I'm not playing with the AI, trust me, I don't even think you can. I actually do not think you can. I know I played them with my brother and stuff when I was younger, but where the hell did you come from? But, um... Yeah, they got, like, other modes and stuff. And then you can do free roam as well, so you can actually explore the track. No checkpoints, no laps, no other racers. Just, you just vibing. <coughs> exploring the track. Uh, I used to love doing that, just going around, exploring the track, seeing where the, um... The end of the track is, pretty much. Uh, but that's about that's really about it with ATV3, man. Um, if you're not big into racing games, maybe you might not like this game. See, like, how I'm not, I'm not accelerating right now. Oh, and I was able to get through that. Thank god. Uh, yeah, if you're not big into like racing games, this is more arcadey, I would say. It's not too realistic. Um, obviously, they have the whole system where you have to like preload, you'll like flick the analog stick when you're making the jump. Obviously, it doesn't really matter in this race because one, it'll slow you down if you try to do that, and two, um, this race doesn't have a whole lot. Like the track itself that they kind of designed for you doesn't really have a whole lot of um, hills and bumps. Like you have those right there, but mainly you're mainly just trying to stay on the ground and get to the end. Um, so we are almost done, I think. I thought they used to tell you how many checkpoints was on this track. I think that's another game I played. I think that's ATV2. ATV2 tells you how many checkpoints you have um, remaining. This game doesn't tell you. You kind of just have to go. 
I almost hit that tree, but I clean that up. So you just have to figure it out on your own. All right. So that's it for that. There's another race. I don't know how long. 15 minutes. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll do it. I don't remember how many tracks. It was five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I think this is the last one. We'll do this real quick. I'll probably just jump cut. Or maybe not. So you guys can see. So, see right here, it gives you a rating. It tells you what type of environment you're going on. So, we're going on the snow track. So, I have to switch my wheels to the snow wheels. So, we do that. And you start. That's really it. That's kind of the only thing that separates this from... Oh, I hate this track. <laughs> That's the only thing that separates this. Um, This game from ATV3, really. What makes it different is it gives you more... Um control and agency over like your tires and your ATV. You can change speeds, acceleration, max speed, handling, um, all of that stuff. I think they do it in ATV too, but to a lesser degree. Um, yeah, let's do this track. Oh, this is another fucking waypoint track. Okay. Yeah. What is that sound? That might be the helicopter up there. I don't know why it's on the thing. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we? What is with all these fucking... Why am I in fifth place? Oh, I'm, I'm just looking at the map over there. Oh, they must have went around. Well, damn, I wish I would have known about that over there. Alright. I ain't even checking my standards to see if I win, but I'm sure I am. <laughs> Won the last like two three races now. How did what? Okay, okay, whatever, 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 bro, whatever. Okay, yeah, we'll probably stop after this because this race is gonna be kind of long. Um, but yeah, like I said, you guys, that's pretty much what Retro Revisit is. I'm just gonna be playing through a lot of older games. Uh, I don't know if you guys consider PS3 Retro. I I don't know. I think it's almost retro because with the PS3 came out in what 20, no, I think 2006 or seven, and the last games came out in well the last main games came out like 2013 before the PS4 came out. So it's 2024. So it's 20. So it'd be 20. So it'd be 20 years in 2026 so we got two more years and some of the later games are about to be 10 years old 10 11 years old right so i don't um, i don't necessarily know if you can consider them retro yet i'll say maybe like next year or 2026 then i'll be like yeah these are these would these would officially be retro now they're 20 years old they're older games now so it's like yeah, they're retro. Like, yeah, they may still some of them may still look good because that was like HD, HD games. They're not like PS2 games like this. Um, but I don't know. But they're getting to that point where they're considering to be retro. So you may not necessarily see PS3 games on there, but eventually I might do um, I might do some walkthroughs maybe on some PS3 games that I played, specifically the Ratchet and Clank games. Uh, shit, frames up like that. Uh, yeah, Pacific, Pacific, specifically, specific. <clears throat> that word kicked my ass, specifically the Ratchet and Clank games, I don't know why I said Pacific, I did just come from Seattle, um, this is me after my birthday vacation, I just came back in, um, just came back in last night, uh, kind of figured, yeah, I, well, I got a little few more days off of work, I'm gonna go ahead and just start getting some stuff done for the channel, but, uh, shit, he got fucking wrecked. Um, but yeah, this is, a uh, this is pretty much all it's going to be. I'll do some PS2 games, some PS, PS1 games will be on here eventually. Uh, there'll be some Game Boy games. Uh, if I can get a way to get to some PSP games, there'll be some PSP games as well. Um, uh, trying to think if there's going to be any other kind of game. Like I said, I didn't grow up with Xbox and Nintendo, so... 
I don't know. I mean, technically they would be retro, but I didn't really grow up with them. But I could play them. Um, shit, shit, shit. There's gonna be some um, walkthroughs on a few games that uh, are would be considered retro. Retro, obviously, you know, I'm playing Sly. Sly and uh, Ben 10 will come eventually, but there's gonna be another one that I haven't mentioned. Um, so yeah, there's there's gonna be some overlap a little bit, but. You'll know when, if there's only like one video on the game, then you'll be like, yeah, that's, he's probably doing just a retro revisited video on it. And if you see like, it's part one, part two, is that a train? Oh, shit. Uh, if you see part one, part two, then you'll be like, okay, yeah, he's doing a series on that. You know, that's pretty much the way I separate it. Mainly I do walkthroughs on games I never played. Um, outside of Benton and Beautiful Joe, those are exceptions, but moving forward, um, I'll do walkthroughs only on games I haven't played yet. Uh, so, like I said, the very first one that'll be considered that is gonna be a racing game. So you'll see it when it come out. Um, still deciding on the schedule during the summer and stuff, uh, and the spring as well. I got a lot of content to give you guys, so it's just a matter of what I want to come out first and what I don't want, you know. But yeah, that's um, that's gonna be it for this. So this month will be. ATV 3, ATV 2, and uh, Team Titans. I don't know what I'm going to do next month. What game I'm going to do next month? Uh, it might actually be a game I haven't recorded yet. Because I have a lot of games recorded for it, but they're all... Um, I think I might want to actually theme them. So, like... Can I say this without being... I mean, it don't even matter if it's a spoiler or not. But, for example, let's say I got a lot of... um Turn up. Turn up, okay. Let's say I got a lot of Crash games right now, right? A lot of older Crash games that I played. So, rather than just doing, I don't know, maybe like three, four videos, you know, during the weekend for Retro Revisited, I can do that, and I can also have up... Ah, oh shit, I just realized I broke my own. You know what, fuck you guys, you know, you don't see... Listen, 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 listen. I just thought about something, that's why I just stopped my thought. But, um, let's just say, right, we'll do a Retro Revisited... For um, for uh, think, 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 think. I'm trying to think. Um, for all the crash games, right? Well, not all of them. We'll do. Shit, man, it might have some overlap. We'll do. We'll do. Let's say four. We'll, let's let's do hypotheticals, right? So let's say I do the first three crash games. I do crash one, crash two, crash three, right? And maybe do OGCTR or do crash bash, right? So, so stick with me here. All right. So we do that for the retro revision. Then I have another crash game that is um a series, a walkthrough series. That'll cover the walkthrough series, right? 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 Stick with me now. And then, and then, then, then we do a time trial series, right? Now, do I know what time trial series I'm gonna do? Absolutely not, because I kind of already did CTR. Um, I'm not gonna do the OG one. Uh, even though I've already started doing the time trials for that game, I'm probably not going to record them. Uh, so what I could possibly do is go back and play the remake. Because there's still a lot of tracks I didn't do yet in the remake. So I can go back and play that. If I feel like doing that, I might do it. Um, just do a few tracks that I haven't done on there. Um, add them to the time trial series for Crash. Because I've been hibernation since the channels kind of started. Um, what else? And yeah, and then you know I have a time through series, time ah, time trial series, time trial series, a walkthrough, and a retro revisit. So then that could be like a whole theme month for Crash. You know, you know, you know, I could do a theme. You know, you know how how y'all feeling about that? And 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 it's not the only game that I have a lot of um. A lot of um, overlap with. There's gonna be some other like series that I have overlap with. So Crash is the only one. Did I win? Okay, I'm done. So yeah, I'll, I'll figure that out. I'm gonna look at the content that I have. Why is that motorcycles a lot? I'll look at the content that I have and I'll start piecing stuff together for you guys. Okay. So see at the end, yeah, you win a trophy. Uh, you can also win silver and bronze, but you know that'll be a skill issue. You know, I'm too good at the game. All right, let me stop writing. Okay, so what was the name of... Oh, National. Okay, so these tracks will be considered National. They're like, you know, 
They're like um regular tracks outside forest um snow resorts like you just saw dams um hills valleys shit like that enduro was the um the waypoint i think yeah enduro was the waypoint so you saw me play that i just go through actually no it's not so enduro is like national but the tracks are harder if that's the best way for me to explain it like the tracks are a little bit longer um do a few more laps stuff like that i haven't finished this because the game keeps crashing every time i do that track i don't know it could be the water who knows um like i said the short track uh this is olympics he's turning on his turn uh, maybe enduro might actually be the i don't know Shit, i ain't gonna find out but uh that'll do it for this video this video is getting kind of long i ain't gonna cap um we're definitely gonna do more retro revisited videos i'm planning on doing atv2 right that'll be the day well not the day the week after this one comes out and then teen titans comes out afterwards i don't have to re-record teen titans at least i don't think i do it is kind of long because those levels are a lot longer than i thought and the game froze and crashed on me so i had to redo the whole level man. Uh, but regardless of the fact i hope you guys still enjoy it um i could possibly do some cool content for teen titans later i forgot it has like a battle mode so we'll see we'll see what i do but uh you guys enjoy the content be sure to like comment and subscribe what you think um as always keep it gaming guys i'll check with you later take care